Welcome to another edition of CFI Tips. My name is Eric Radke, Chief Instructor at Sporties, and I'm here with Matt Berwinkle, another Sporty CFI, and today's topic is ground reference maneuvers. So, Matt, you know, as a CFI working with a lot of primary students, obviously you spend a lot of time on ground reference maneuvers. So are there some things you're seeing right now in terms of technique or procedure that uh, all the other student pilots uh, out there could benefit from? Uh, yeah, what I see is a lot of people when they're doing turns around a point specifically is they will pick a point, uh, line up with it on the downwind like they're supposed to, and then they roll in when the point hits the front of the wing tip or it hits the wing strut. Uh, and then at that point, they are in, they're uh, getting in too close to the point right from the beginning. They end up kind of spiraling in and then the maneuver ends up having to be scrapped because they're in too close. Uh, so what I like to tell a lot of students is to wait until the point is lined up with their back to kind of force them to, to wait an extra couple seconds to start the turn. Uh, that gives them enough space and time to kind of get uh, properly spaced out and then they can do the whole maneuver um, as it's intended to be done. Matt, that's great advice there. You know, another thing as an instructor, we're always, you know, thinking about the unexpected, all those what-if scenarios. So I'm sure, you know, for you personally, you're thinking about, you know, worst case scenario, some type of malfunction or engine failure, where you're going to go. Are your, are your students seeing that thing, th those types of things? Or are they planning ahead as they identify spaces to do these maneuvers? Uh, yeah, well, I always kind of stress that too because you end up doing these a lot lower than you're typically maneuvering So you want to have an out if uh, something does go wrong So I always like to stress uh, that that's to be something they think about prior to even descending to begin the maneuver Is picking a suitable landing site making sure they're clear of any obstacles nearby um, And then just making sure that they have a, a sort of a plan fleshed out before we even get down to a low altitude to start those maneuvers Matt, thanks a lot and thanks for joining us uh, for another edition of CFI Tips